Hey guys, so today I wanted to hop on and just do a quick skincare overview of some products that I'm currently using, some products that I've recently tried that I wanted to recommend um, you check out and just give you a little bit of insight into what I'm currently using and what I think works. So I use a lot of different types of products, um, always a cleanser, always a moisturizer, I'm always using different types of serums, under eye creams, things like that. So I have a few here that I really like that I've recently tried, some of which you probably haven't heard of before because they're not available at the drugstore, um, but they're totally worth trying out and I really like them. So the first one that I've recently been using is the Kate Somerville Retinol Vita C Power Serum and this is a light serum. It comes in a relatively small bottle. So you only need a little bit at a time for this one. It is just a light cream. And I really like how this comes on. You use it at night only and once a day. So you just apply a thin layer um, to your face and your neck. And right now I have makeup on, so I'll just put on. It smells really nice, very citrusy, and I really like how it goes on. It doesn't feel sticky, it doesn't feel heavy. Um, it's just a really nice light coating and that's, a really good brand too if you haven't used the Kate Somerville products before really good skincare line um, another one that I will run into is the say yes to grapefruit dark circle correcting eye cream so this is a just like a long tube this is a lot of product in it for what you pay for it so it's really affordable for what it is and it lasts a long time um, but I really like how this goes on as well this is a bit of a darker cream you can't really tell here but it's more of a beige and you just apply it right under your eyes so that's a really good one if you are looking for a dark circle corrector especially if you're like me and you stay up way too late sometimes um, you work full time and have a million other things to do you need this <laughs> the next thing is this control corrective skincare systems set so I just wanted to Keep the box so you could kind of see it with me. So the product that I've really been liking from their collection is the Soothing Chamomile Eye Makeup Remover. I don't like a lot of eye makeup removers because I feel that they burn my eyes. Not a fan. I also don't love the wipes because I feel like they don't really clean well enough. And this one is great if you have sensitive eyes or if you have sensitive skin. I love how this cleans off the makeup. Um, and it really is very gentle and it does the job. So this is a great product if you are looking for a new makeup remover, especially for those of you who have more sensitive um, skin, especially around your eyes. I have lots of goodies here. So the next one I wanted to show another one that I really have been liking is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Tinted Moisturizer. So we're I almost dropped it. <laughs> so we're almost out of this now. It is SPF 30, so it was amazing in the summer. I haven't used it too much now because I'm getting a little lighter, so I have to get a lighter shade, but this is almost gone because we've used a ton of it. Um, but this is great for sensitive skin as well, and it gives you a really nice even skin tone, uh, especially if you're not wearing makeup. I really like to just throw this on with a little bit of mascara in my hair, and I find that that's just like the perfect amount for an everyday look if you're just running off to work, doing errands, things like that. So those are four of my favorites from different brands right now that I've been using that I can highly recommend. I will link everything down below. The next little collection I want to show you is all Sunday Riley. So I just started trying their products. A lot of people recommended them. I've heard great things, so I wanted to try them out for myself. They provided these ones for the review, so I was able to kind of give them some time and test them out. The one I do really like is the Martian Mattifying Water Gel Toner. This is a really great product. I love what it does for your skin. Um, it definitely tightens your pores and makes your skin look a bit, a bit clearer. Um, it is something that I have really liked using and feel it makes a difference. 
and it's especially great for oily and acne prone skin so if you're someone who breaks out a lot if there are certain times that you know you do this is a really good product to help both prevent and satisfy or soothe those breakouts another one that i really like so save the boxes to show you um this is the ceo and this is a vitamin c and e oxidant moisturizer so if you're not using a tinted moisturizer this is a really good one to use as an alternative um obviously i don't use the tinted moisturizer at night before i go to bed so this is a really good one to use at night my hand looks huge like this i it smells good it's nice and light it kind of has a bit of a citrusy scent so it's not um too overbearing it does feel really good on though and it is known for fighting the visible effects of micro pollution induced skin aging and sensitivity so to give you the technical terms, that's what it says in the back. It really does look great on, and you definitely feel how good it, it feels once you do apply it to your skin. There's nothing better than having healthy moisturized skin, so moisturizer, use it day and night. If you feel you need it more often, use it. Find one that works for you. I've had some that don't, so these ones are really good tinted and non-tinted. I also have other recommendations as well. I could do a whole video on moisturizers. I swear I've tried so many. Um, there aren't too many I don't like, but these ones are definitely some of the best I've used. So the next product is also part of the CEO collection. This is their Rapid Flash Brightening Serum, and this comes in a small bottle. It's 15% vitamin C. So this is a really great product um, to give you an idea of how you would use it. You apply one to two pumps, if you have the larger bottle, to your skin morning and night. So this is something you're going to use twice a day. I only have this little guy right here, but it does actually last me a decent amount of time, which is surprising. Maybe I'm not using enough, but I do like how this works, and it definitely seems to brighten the skin that I do put it on. So it does its job. And again, like the other CEO product, it's very moisturizing and it definitely shows on your face. Um, maybe not the same day, but once you use it for a couple of days, you'll start seeing the positive results from using their CEO products. This is a cleanser by Sunday Riley. It is the Ceramic Slip Clay Cleanser. And I haven't used too many clay cleansers. I love they kind of do all this fancy packaging, um, but to show you what it looks like, it you can't really see it from there, but it, they just have really clean, crisp packaging. Um, this is their ceramic slip clay cleanser for normal to oily skin. It is made with French green clay, Moroccan rustle lava clay, vitamin C, black pepper, neroli, and a few other essential oils that are really great for your skin. So the bottle comes in one of the pumps like these. I love these because they're so much easier to use. Same with my shampoo and conditioners. I always recommend using one that's easy just to pump it right into your hand, especially if you are do it using it in the bathroom or in the shower. It makes it way easier than having to twist the top off, wet hands, and forget about it. So these make life so much easier. Um, it is pretty watery. I do like how this works. However, it's not the best cleanser I've used. I have definitely used ones that I've liked a little bit more. I do like the idea of the clay cleanser, but I've found that the charcoal cleansers actually exfoliate and work a little bit better on my own skin. But this is worth trying, especially if you're someone with, you know, everyday normal to slightly oily skin. Um, that's what they recommend it for. And it can help with purifying your overall complexion, which is something that a lot of us need, especially when our skin starts to get sad, when it gets cold and winter stinks here. So worth trying.
the last one it's kind of interesting so this is the first product I've used of this kind this is the Sunday Riley lactic acid treatment so it comes in this it's a little bottle here you can't see anything my lighting is no good so this is for exfoliating clarity radiance and younger looking skin it brightens the appearance of dark spots so similar to the under eye dark spot remover except this can be used on other areas of your face it's actually made with purified grade lactic acid i'm reading the box for you and it exfoliates the surface of the skin which can remove poor clogging dead skin cells which doesn't that sound great we all need that and it can be hard to uh, clean i think sometimes get really deep in your pores so this is a, a cool product to try again i haven't needed it too much yet but as i continue to use it i'll keep you updated on how it goes overall i really like their products i really like all of these brands they've all been great for my skin I know they've recommended the <laughs> I've recommended them to others who have also really liked them and I've heard great things. So I will link them all here for you to check them out. I'm also going to be talking about these on my Instagram stories. So if you don't follow me yet, you can follow me on at Bianca Blogs on Instagram. You can also find my blogs at biancablogs.com. I'm looking to do a lot more product review videos, so I'd love if you have anything you'd like to see, just comment below and I would be happy to get that out for you. Thanks again for tuning in.